Hello, hello everyone. Hi, good night. Good night, Javi. All right, so um, hello, Karen. How are you today? Hello, I'm fine. Right, that's great, that's great. So Thursday, Thursday, you know. All right, so we're gonna wait a couple of uh, minutes to see how many uh, participants join this uh, conversation. Practice for tonight. All right. So, so far in the house, we have a uh, German. Welcome, sir. Hello, good night. How are you? Good night. Yeah, I'm good. Thanks. What about you? Nice, nice. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Thursday. Uh, so, we have Karen, Miguel, so Robert, Robert Celaya, Xavi said hi already, and I have uh, Luis who just joined and so eight participants so far that you know that's a good number to start with you know tonight we have uh, three uh, conversations to practice so I've uh, you know look for this material and you know I'm going to be sharing that with you the first one is used to the second one simple pass like the questions you guys have been practicing, you know, during these last two weeks. And the uh, last one is conversation with was and were. But the three conversations are brand new. So you haven't actually had the opportunity to practice in this class. Great. But, you know, before we actually address the uh, the conversations, let me give you a reminder, okay? Hold on, please. What is this screen? There we go. Right. Let me just one sec coming here. Hello. Hello, Shavi. All right, so just a friendly reminder. Let me ask you. Uh so I'm sorry, Alex. So Alex, are you able to see the screen and sharing with everyone over here? Yes, yes, sir. Nice. So this is just a friendly reminder. Rem remember that you know by this week you're supposed to mm -hmm. complete section one, two, and three. And also you need to take the midterm exam, right? I if you really, already. Okay, if you already did it, so no problem. But at least, mm -hmm. you know, that's the minimum uh, advance that you should have uh, to this point, you know, today, or at least this week. All right. So maybe if you haven't uh, had the opportunity to check this out, uh, you may work tomorrow or over the weekend, you know, Saturday, Sunday, you know, why not? So, uh, and you know, tonight we're going to finish, you know, to talk about the past. Next mm -hmm. week, my plan is to, to review with you uh, this indirect questions, you know, that based on my personal opinion, if you know how to use indirect questions correctly, that means you have at least an intermediate English level or more. All right. Okay. Because most of the time you're not going to be asking questions directly you know so focus on this uh letter f exercise on section three in direct questions you know we're going to review them next week and as i said everyone today i mean tonight's 
focus will be used to, then simple past, and then was where. Nice. Mm -hmm. So that being said, let's see how many participants we have tonight. Hold on, please. And here we go. 11 participants. And let's see, uh, what time is it? 8.04, yeah, I think, you know, we should start right away. All right, so I'm um, gonna ask. So Brenda, could you please confirm that I'm uh, that I'm sharing the screen with you, with everyone correctly? Can you see the one that says tonight's word? Hey, Brenda? Hello? Yeah, I mean, are you able to see the screen I'm sharing? Can you see uh, the presentation? Can you repeat me, please? Yeah, can- uh, Yes, yes, can I you? can, thank you. Okay, you're welcome, thanks. All right, so this is the, the, the one. Give the green light, all right? Can anybody tell me if you have any idea what this means? Actually, this is uh, similar to an expression we use in Spanish. And, and I would say it's exactly the same thing, okay? So anybody over here? To give somebody to, uh, permission? Yeah, that's correct. That means to give someone permission to do something or anything, do something. you know. Right. Yes, nice. And, okay, let's go by the dictionary definition. What does the dictionary, you know, tell us? To give permission for someone to do something or for something to happen, all right? And that's why, you know, I underlined and highlighted permission and, and, and also happen. Because if you give the green light to someone, or if you give someone the green light, you're telling them, yeah, go ahead, do it, please, no problem. You know, nothing, uh, there won't be consequences or repercussions, okay? Now, okay. let's use an ex another example in here, to allow someone to do something in here, okay? So, I, I'm sorry, this is another definition and simple. What about an example sentence? We have the council, has given the green light to the new shopping center. And I, you know, over here, I'm going to give a commercial. So are you aware, are you aware that in um, Apopa, you know, a new shopping center will be open? Do you know that already? Yes. Yeah, so that means that the council or the city council, you know, of, of Apopa, you know, gave, the green light, you know, to these people to open or to to build this mm -hmm. new shopping center, right? Yes. So this this expression is pretty simple, and you guys can use it. All right. Now, but there's another uh, version to to this idiom. So it's get the green light. So sometimes, you know, you ask for permission. Okay. You ask, you know, for permission to your wife. <laughs> you might feel identified with this, right? Yes, so you ask, so honey, remember yesterday, uh, so may I, okay, may I go uh, to the bar, I don't know, this coming Saturday because it's, you know, a classical Real Madrid against Barcelona. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, so and you got to wait if she gives you the green light, okay? So you're going to get the green light or not, okay? Right, yeah. So, so in other words, if you get permission, you say, okay, yeah, I give you the green light. But if you ask for, for the permission, you need to get it, okay? Get the green light over there. So that being said, take a look at this example. And once mm -hmm. we're done with this, I'll show you the scope, you know, and, and the, uh, the contents that we're going to cover tonight. We're just waiting to get the green light from our managers before we release the latest software update, okay? And let me ask, somebody over here uh, you know it's mainly uh boys so in this class now so i'm gonna ask uh, hilda hilda uh could you give me a literal translation to both expressions give the green light and also get the green light please um tener luz verde Tener la luz verde. Okay. Okay, thank you. 
and I'm going to ask German, could you please give me a translation to both expressions and if we can actually use them or apply them in a real conversation? How about that? Well, uh, the first one, um, okay. Tienes verde, tienes luz verde para comenzar el proyecto, por ejemplo. Right, yeah? okay. Yeah, correct, yeah. Uh, yes, and the other one. Um, Okay, estamos esperando que nos den luz verde para comprar. Ajá, 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 exactly, exactly. If you're the ones, if you're the one asking for permission or for the authorization, okay, so you need to get the green light before you start something, okay. So the, you know they're gonna give you, you're gonna get it, okay. Simply okay. like that, okay. Yeah, nice. Okay. So that being said, everyone. I'm going to show you the first thing you, you're going to be practicing tonight. Conversation number one is uh, about used to. Just one thing, as you can see, it's between a man and a woman. It's not like the one yesterday, you know, Jimmy or James and Sarah Roberts. This time there are no characters, so you can replace the name with your real names. And okay. don't get surprised. This is about the simple past. What happens is that in a real conversation, you don't really need to use, you know, did you use or did you play, did you go to ask? You can ask, do you play soccer or do you play sports? And you can, you can answer, I used to play sports in high school. Or you can say, yes, I do play sports. I, or yes, I, I play soccer or I play basketball. But you know what I mean over here? Yes. Okay, yeah. so the, the second conversation is pretty much the same thing, but the woman answers, I speak, uh, I speak it a little. I used to use it all the time, but not anymore. And as you know, used to means something that you did in the past, you know, as a habit, but you no longer do. Okay, that's the definition for used to. If you make the translation, that means solía or soler. All right. So conversation three, same sequence over there, same format, used to. All right. Uh, and also, you see, conversation number four, it's informal because you don't really have to ask, okay, do you, or I mean, did you used to have a Spanish co-worker, right? You can ask, you used to have a Spanish worker, right? As long as you make the right intonation, you're good. Copy that, everyone. Okay. Nice. And I'm going to ask you to also take the quiz, but not right now, don't do anything. Okay, and you're going to test how much you understood out of the conversation. It would be great that just like, uh, just like the other material, like yesterday, you know, you would be just listening to the conversation without reading the, uh, the script, this one. And if I were you, you know, I'd do that. Okay, then this is the second conversation. You're going to practice. You're going to listen to it. Then number two, you're going to uh, take this quiz. We're going to share, you know, uh, what you did in there. And then we have the last conversation. You got the quiz and pretty much we're going to be done with the class tonight. Okay. So we have a deal. Yes, sir. All right. Yes. So it sounds, okay. it, it sounds like a plan, right? <laughs> 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 nice. Yeah. So I'm going to send you the first access to the, uh, this conversation over here. The one about sports in a second. Okay, one moment, please. All right, so I just send information to the group chat that you have uh, on the other uh, chat, you know, personal chat, Portuguese guide again. And uh, I'm going to, and let me send it also to the, okay? Okay. Can you please confirm that you got it on the personal chat, you yeah, know, the it. one we have. Yes, okay. Yes. okay. Uh -huh. Just to make sure, uh, let me send it over here. Okay. Uh, nice. There you go. 
Nice. Uh, let me send you to the breakout rooms. Remember, it will be great if you listen to this individually, okay? And then uh, listen to the conversation and then practice with the classmates. So it would be great that you get familiar with conversation number one, it's the main idea, two, three, and four. Let's try to do it, you know? Try to do it. Let's try to be honest over here. Yes? Yes, sir. Nice. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so you've been assigned to someone, you know, to practice with. Go ahead, please. All right, so uh, go ahead, please, and, and join the breaker rooms. Let's see who has been joining here. So Miguel, oh yeah, nice. And Robert, there we go. And... Continue, Miguel, with you, if you want. Okay. Okay, conversation one. Do you play sports? I used to play sport in high school. Yeah, I used to play sports too. What do you stop? No time, I guess. Yeah, I used to have so much free time. Me too. I miss those days. Okay. Okay, the conversation, conversation. number two. Yes. Okay. Do Okay. Conversation four. Hey, you used to have a Spanish co-worker, right? Yeah, Maria, but she moved. Oh, really? That's too bad. Yeah, I really miss working. Okay, German, uh, we have to practice the conversation now, right? Go ahead and practice with German, uh, Angel. Okay. 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 Uh, start with this for conversation number one. Okay. Okay. Well, Go ahead. Uh, okay. Do you play sports? Uh, I used to play sports in high school. High school. Yeah, you used to play too. Why did you stop? No, time and guess. Yeah, I used to have so much free time. Me too. I missed two days. <laughs> okay. But hey, you used to have a Spanish co-worker, right? Yeah, Maria Beth. She moved. Really? That's too bad. Yeah, I really miss working with her. Yeah, I like her. She used to always make me laugh. I know, we used to have so, such fun together. Right. Okay, and so then... Interchange? Uh, yeah, change roles. All right. Okay, conversation one. And do you play sports? I used to play sports in high school. Uh, yeah, I used to play too. And why do you stop? Not time, I guess. Yeah, I used to have so much free time. Me too. I miss those days. You think we gotta go back to the to the main? Yes. <laughs> right. No, but not. Oh, not 
I used to play sports. Don't hear it, teacher. Don't hear it. Yeah, can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah um... Oh my god. Plugged <laughs> in, but I don't know why uh, this thing um, wasn't working right there. Yeah, did I did I catch you in the middle of the practice over there? Did I get you? Yes. All right. Sorry about that. The thing is that I, I just wanted to see if there were new participants in this uh, meeting. And now I see that I have more people. So I have uh, Alex, very quick. Let me just name name uh, you very quickly. So uh, Alex, Angel, Brenda, Edgar, Herman, Hilda, Jacqueline, Karen, uh, Karen Galdames, Luis, Miguel, Roberto, Alas, Roberto, Celaya, Veronica, and Javier Rivas. I think I yes. mentioned everyone, right? Yeah. Right, and so, I... yes, sir. Uh, sorry for connect late. <laughs> no, not a problem. I mean, yeah, I understand. But I mean, you were going to miss this conversation. They're not uh, as interesting as the ones you, you practiced yesterday. But you know, at least you're going to have uh, the opportunity to practice. So let me send you one more time to the uh, breakout rooms. And this time, I'll be sharing the second conversation. OK? So. Let me just one second, please. Let me, of course, you know, share the access to the, to the conversation, all right? Before anything else. And as, okay. Uh, okay, and as usual, it's going to be in this both, you know, in both channel, the personal group we have, and then this meeting chat. Okay. All right, so. Yeah, yeah you see the Portuguese guy approves it, you know. <laughs> 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 yeah, he gives me, you know, he gave me the green light. Go ahead, he said. Okay. I think so, right? Okay. Uh, bear with me just one second. I. It's in bad it's, it's past tense. The conversation, uh, the conversation is, uh, is in past tense. It's in past tense. Just to, uh, let me just share, share the screen in here, just so you practice the correct one. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay, just one second. I'm going to share the screen with you, you know, just for a couple of seconds. And then you let me know if you're able to see it in here. Hold on. Can you hear me? Yes? Yes. yes. Nice. So this is the one, you know, I just sent to you. Could, could, could somebody, you know, double check it? That's the one? No, need, no, it's the same. Okay, okay, okay. Is it this one? Like, what did you do yesterday? It's the same. What did you do yesterday? Yesterday was my day off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Okay. Ah, yes, it's the same. <laughs> nice. I thought it was the same as the previous one, but now it's the same your watch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You, you got me. Yeah. Okay. So, do you give me the green light, you know, to put you in groups or in person? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Of course. Yeah, do we? I mean, I'm just trying to use the uh, the the idiom over there. You know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Okay, so Elio is with Veronica, Karen with Roberto, Angel with Roberto Alas, Hilda with Javier, Alex with uh, Jacqueline, German with Karen, and uh, Brenda with Luis, Edgar with Miguel Franco. Nice. Sixteen participants. Join the meetings, please. If I were you, I would listen to the conversation first and then get the main idea and get to practice, okay? Really? Okay. All right. Okay. Let me just, before you, you start, I don't take, let's say, a minute to listen to the conversation individually and don't look at the script, please. And if you like, you can write the main idea. This is just one complete conversation, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is okay. not divided in, this is not divided in one, two, three, or four. So instead, play the listening, be quiet, and just get some ideas down. Believe me, that helps to your comprehension. Okay? Okay. okay. And then Thank practice. You. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Was my day of Thursday day early and Finishes all of of house shares before work. 
I cleaned the kitchen, model the life, my love song layers, and time and and paint the trash and watch my clothes. I even does the furniture. Let me let me stop you right yeah, there. Well, excuse me, Roberto. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. Would you yes. like me? Would you like me to help you with some pronunciation details over here? Okay. I mean, can, can I help you with with you know? To uh, I mean to to give you, let's say an example of how to pronounce certain words. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. So do you give me the green light? I mean, I'm asking seriously. <laughs> <laughs> so can I go ahead and, 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 and uh, you know, pretend I'm the man and the woman? Just, just listen to me, please. Okay. Okay. Over here. Okay. So we have yesterday was my day off. I studied the day early and finished up. Finished up a lot of house chores before work. I cleaned the kitchen, mowed the lawn mail some letters, empty the trash, and wash my clothes. I even dusted the furniture. Furniture. Okay. Furniture. Okay, so I'm not going to ask the question because that's pretty simple. After that, I walked to work because I needed to do some things for my job. I didn't take the bus because it looked full. I enjoyed the walk, though, as I strolled through, um, through the park to my office. And then the woman replies, it, it, yes, I know, I did work, work for about three hours, I checked some emails and finished the paper. I needed to send to a customer. And then right below, she says, no, after that, I walked to my local gym. I exercised for about one hour. I've lifted, lifted weights and walked on the treadmill for some time. Then I showered and headed home. You know, shower and headed, headed home. Se me dirigí, headed, como cabeza, pero le da como dirigirse a... And luego dice, at home, I cooked dinner and chatted with my roommate. After eating, I cleaned up the kitchen. I wanted to watch a movie, but it was too late. So I decided, decided not to. All in all, it was a good day. All right? Okay. okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Now get to practice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. If you want, uh, I start. Okay. To the park. To my office as a stroll was a little bit. Okay. Imagino que es como, como trotar. Puede ser, sí. <laughs> um, vamos a ver. Teacher, hi. We have a question. Oh. Yeah, what's the uh, question? Uh, what does stroll mean? It's like oh. jogging. It's like jogging. Oh, yeah. oh, okay, you okay. were right, Karen. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that was the, the word that I didn't understand. Yeah, I mean, you go like slowly or you like walk. It's like, you know, stroll. Like when you go, when you go, when you go like uh, and walk the dog, you're, you're like strolling yes. over there like. En español trotando. Mm. Algo así, digamos. Es como un sinónimo, pero. Entre caminar y trotar. Uh -huh. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. Uh, you know, there's there's a place, and I'm gonna send it to you over here in this personal chat. Since I'm, let me just stop sharing this as well. Okay. Okay. And uh, I'm gonna send this to you. This, you know, has saved my life. You know, trust me. Okay. okay. This the following thing. I'm gonna send it. You know, to be a gentleman to Karen first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yes. For example, if you wanna, if you want to uh, find a word, you just type. For example, in this case, it's a stroll, and then put the words I'm giving you right now, which I'm not supposed to tell you. So, and then that's what you put over there. If you do that, it's stroll plus word, and then you you put the reference as I did in there. Uh, you're gonna be able to find it. Just go to Google and do that. You can do it right now. Just just to you know, do that that I did demonstration. <laughs> The demo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it worked. Okay, and then just go there. And uh, 
and then you can change it. It, it, it gives you the English and Spanish ten. It gives you synonyms, antonyms, pretty much everything. So yeah. it's slow walk. It's like you slow walk. Okay, o dar una vuelta. Think, you got it? I've seen that. Yeah, yeah. I've seen that type before. You, you've seen that. Okay. I yeah. use this. Trust me. I would say every single day. Okay. Have Thank you seen you. that before, German? Uh, well, I, I didn't uh, receive anything. Let me see. Ah, sorry about that. Yes. I just, yeah, sorry about that, man. Yeah, sorry about that. No worries. Okay. Sorry, sir. Yeah. All right. So the, the way it works is. Um, just like that. So put the word, you know, in the search bar and just put, you know, word plus the reference over there. You know, it's going to give you, okay, the reference right there. Okay. Work. Is it working? Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, it, it, yeah. let me let me also share with, with you, you know, a screenshot of you know how you know the uh, you know some results look like. Okay. You know, I gotta be careful right now because you know this information gets you know uploaded into into YouTube and we may have copyright uh, issues okay, okay. if we're if we're not help you know uh, that's what I, I never say you know I'm gonna send you the information I said access you know ten okay. so that that's why <laughs> like no quiera, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, well. so there you go it's gonna look just like this yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes 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 okay yes it's okay this place is beautiful. Trust me. <laughs> now, get to practice. Now, I mean, did you practice already? Yes. Yes, yes. already. Yes. Do you have any questions for me in regards to the converse? I mean, to the uh, pronunciation or, or, or a verb or something, or you're, you're good? Oh, I have a problem with empty, empty. Uh, yeah, empty. You say you just say it like in like in press empty. Empty. Yeah. If you like, I can also, uh, you know, try to pronounce it like, I, I, would, I would do it very, very quickly, you know, that might help you. However, you also have the, the listening over there, okay? Okay. So, so would that be okay for you, German? Or would you like yes. to keep on practicing? Okay, it's up to you. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Uh, so I'm just going to play the role of the woman in there and just going to focus on the specific verse. You know, remember that in here you have different pronunciations like work, it, and the, those ones, okay? But when you put those words together, you know, in a sentence with a bunch of words, you don't really have to pronounce the end of the verb. And that's a tip. Okay. Okay, that, that tip is worth, you know, $100. <laughs> no, trust me, you know, that actually makes your life easier. So here we go. Yesterday was my day off. I started the day early and finished up and fin finished up, finished up a lot of house chores before work. I cleaned the kitchen, mowed the lawn, mailed some letters, emptied the trash and washed my clothes. You don't really have to say washed. No. So, and washed my clothes. Yes. I even dusted the furniture, dusted, you know, sacudir. And yes. then, after that, I walk to the to work. You don't have to say what and then to no, just make a link sound. You know, link the sound. What? To? Yeah, I walk to work. Mm -hmm. Okay, because I need it. Because I needed to do some things for my job. I didn't take the bus because it looked full. You don't have to say it looked full. No, don't do it. Native speakers don't do it. Okay, the bus because it looked full. I enjoyed the walk. Okay, and uh, look at this one. I enjoyed the walk. You don't have to say I enjoyed the, and then that because it's the same sound. You see, I enjoyed that walk. So, okay. as I stroll through the park to my office, and then we scroll down. And I know I did work. 
I worked for about three, you don't have to say I worked. No, you say I worked for about three hours. I checked some emails and finished tap a key C because it's a, it's a vowel sound. Okay, aquí no podemos camuflajear. You know, you cannot hide it. So in finish type of paper, I need it. I need it. I need it to send to a customer. And then you go. Uh, now after that, I walk to my local gym. You see, I walk to. I exercise for about an hour. I lifted, lifted weights and walked on. You see, walked on. Como está una vocal, tengo que pronunciarlo. I walked on. I walked on the treadmill for some time. Then I showered and headed, headed home, headed, you know, go. And then I cooked dinner and chatted, chatted with my roommate after eating. I cleaned up, you know, cleaned up, cleaned up, up. I cleaned up the kitchen. I wanted to watch a movie, but it was too late. So I decided, decided not to. All in all, it was a good day, as you can see. German yeah. and uh, Karen, uh, I think this conversation summarizes your practice. You know all the of the different pronunciations uh, of, of the words. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to. Okay, I'm going to uh, bring you back to the main session and give you the third conversation. Okay. 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 Nice. Hold on, please. All right. Let, you, let us have a half conversation. <laughs> yeah, that, that was a long conversation, right? Yes. Yeah. But, yes. you know, I was, you know, I was practicing with uh, some of you, you know, I didn't have the opportunity to go to all the uh, rooms in there. But right now you're going to be, I'd say, uh, I'd say the uh, key participants, you know, or the active participants. Let's see. Uh, so German, would you like to help us, sir? Because I think it's better if you actually, uh, you know, help us in here. Okay. Because you know the teacher can speak and speak, but in the end, I want you to actually to get more more fluent on this. Help us with the verse, please, in here. Or maybe you can practice with somebody here just to make it more entertaining. So, a lady, please. <laughs> German, and then you're gonna be the man, of course. And then we need a a volunteer, you know, but a a, a young or a beautiful lady. Karen, all right? So Karen Eunice. Yes, Eunice. <laughs> yeah, Karen Eunice, thank you. Hi. So, all right, one second here. Uh, okay. So, German, go ahead, please. Okay, what did you do yesterday? Uh, yesterday was my day off. I start the day early. I finish up a lot of house chores. Um, before work, I clean the kitchen, mow the lawn, uh, mail some letter, empty the trash, and wash my clothes. I even do the funeral service. Wow! What did you do after that? Yeah. After that, I walk to work uh, because I need to do something for my job. I didn't take the bus because it looked full. I enjoyed the the walk through uh, as I stroll to the park to my office. Wait, did you work? It was your day off. Yes, I know. I did work. I work for about three hours. I check some mail, emails, and finish a paper I need to send to a customer. Did you work long? Mm, no, after that. I walk to my local gym. I exercise for about one hour. I lift, I lift to wait and walk on the, tr on the treadmill for some time. Then I shower and head home. What did you do last night? At home, I cook dinner and chat with my roommate. After eating, I clean up the kitchen. I want to watch a movie, but it was too late, so I decided not to. All in all, it was a good day. That was a good conversation. Thank you so much. Let me just go over very quickly to the verse. So let's focus on the woman, because the woman you know, is the one that speaks the most in here, OK? Have a deal in here. Just if if I were you, I would just write the, the following verse, or I don't know, just to highlight them and see the pronunciation in there, because you need to pronounce the ending to these verbs. 
Okay. Uh, what is the meaning of move? Move. Move no, is like you cut the green grass. Of course, it's green, right? You, you cut uh -huh. the grass. Okay. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. Here in Salvador, we don't really do this. You know, I'm a mortal. You know, I just chop that, right? <laughs> so that's what I did. So listen to the pronunciation. Start it or start it. Started. Finish up. Finish up. Okay. Finished up. Cleaned. And then mow the lawn, mail, uh, emptied, washed. But just one second. Washed. If if you say the verb washed. With, with another word, you don't say washed. You just say washed my clothes. You know, wash my clothes. Washed. But you don't say wash it. Don't say wash it. Okay. Washed. But on this one, you gotta say dusted. Dusted the furniture. Sacudir, verdad? Dusted the furniture. Okay. And then we hope we, we got this one. Remember this, please. Uh, walk to walk, but we don't say walked to work twice. We say walk to work or walk to, okay? Needed. Walk to work. Okay, you say walk to work. So, needed. 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 Next one is, you know, looked full. Okay, look, enjoy. Look, look full. Look enjoyed. Look enjoyed. Strolled. Strolled. Okay. What is that? A stroll is like to walk, like uh, like in a relaxed way when you go to the park, like for, when you go, for example, when, when you're dark over there, you know. Oh, okay. Como ir a pasear. And then, uh, but we're going to do something. I think I'm going to assign this as homework. But what you're going to do is just to send this conversation to me, you know, for next Monday because it's going to help you, you know, to uh, to practice this. Let's move to the another, to the third conversation. All right. Okay. But just that, just to be clear, you know, try to pronounce like finished, and then finished. Go, okay, and needed. Uh, what is needed in there? Needed. Needed. And, okay, that's needed. it. Dusted. Here, the last one, I cleaned up. Cleaned up. Cleaned up. Cleaned up. Cleaned up. Cleaned up. Okay. There we go. Okay. I'm going to send uh, to you the third conversation. Let's see if someone is chatting in here. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Uh, I'll say the translation right here. So, that's it. Es como sacudir, el, sacudir es dust o polvo, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. y, yeah, yeah. Y, Sacudir el polvo es dust, como dust in the in the wind, right? Like the sun, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And treadmill is where you exercise, you know, where you do cardio. No, this is oh, okay. okay. That's a treadmill, you know. All right. So third conversation. And uh, uh, let me just one moment me here. All right, just one second here. All right, the same conversation is being sent to all of you, to the personal chat and also to the meeting chat. Yeah. Okay, so can somebody just confirm with me you that it. you got, got it. it? Thank you. There you go. Uh, split you again, <laughs> but get familiar with the conversation, please. Okay. Okay. It's the other. It's not the same. So I want to share. I want to share the screen with you. Can you see the screen over here? I'm sharing with you. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, just one moment, please. This is the conversation, and uh, yeah, it's different. As you can see, it's long. <laughs> okay, yeah, so really long. yeah, but I think the, in this hour, yeah, in this hour, you become bilingual. You know, full English. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Besides the Portuguese guy, you know, we speak English. <laughs> yeah, about this. <laughs> about it. <laughs> nice. Uh, so, go to the breaker rooms. I'm going to open them again. Hold on. Okay. Uh,
let's see. Um, all right, so hopefully uh, you have a new partner to practice with. Okay, ahead, thanks. Please. Okay. So I'll be visiting you in there, okay. I start and you continue. Okay. Yeah. Oh, was your summer vacation? <laughs> Great. I went to Italy with my family. I was so fun there. Uh, with me lots of really nice people and ate really delicious food. Where did you stay? We stayed at home or no, <laughs> we stay at hotel. Uh, hotel. <laughs> at a hotel. At a hotel. 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 <laughs> Sorry. Uh, we stay at hot hotel on the beach. So we walk up every day to the sunrise over the water. Water. Each day we swim on in the ocean and took a long walk to the beach at night. We sat and watched the stars. Watch the stars. Watch the stars. We mm -hmm. saw so many stars. If you like in here you can switch the role. I mean you you in, in half have the conversation let's switch the role so here because I think it's too long. Okay, okay. So let's see, Hilda, you can be the man, and then Edgar, you're going to be the woman uh, parking there, you know, so you can actually practice. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm the man? Yes, you, you be the man, and uh, you continue with the conversation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just follow, follow with the conversation over there. Did anything exciting happen? So now, Hilda, you make the questions, and uh, Edgar, and answers you know mm, okay how was your summer vacation no, no, but let's in okay. the middle like did anything exciting happen ah okay did anything exciting happen yes one day we found a wallet on the beach we took the man's name was name was jerry he told us about the town and gave us types of our vacation that night he painted up the may because he was happy, we found his wallet, got it back to him. We knew he will be friends forever. Whoa, what a great trip. <laughs> now, yeah. uh, if okay. you like, now we're going like to change. Uh -huh, let's switch. Okay. Over. Nice. Okay, I'm going to be the man. Yeah, we cannot hear you. Um, we can hear you, Jacqueline. Elio, can you hear Jacqueline? Elio? Over the water. Each day we swam in the ocean and took long walks on the beach. At night we sat and watched the stars. We saw so many stars. Did you? Our vacation. That's nice. He paid for the meal because he was happy. We found his wallet and got it back to him. We knew he would be friends forever. Wow, what a, a great trip. Okay, very good. If you want one more time, no? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if you like, if you like, uh, let me just uh, take you back to the main uh, session so you can take the quiz. Okay, of the three conversations. Okay, oh, okay. And, and then once you take the quiz and you give me, okay, I got a perfect score, I'm going to send you the last time to practice with somebody else. And in there, you can choose the first, second, or third conversation to practice. Okay. Okay. Yeah, sounds like a plan, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. See you in the main session there.
T-shirt. Yes. I have a question. Uh, the the video class has been recorded, no? Yeah, it, it's being recorded right now. Ah, okay. And um, where can I find the, the video class? In yeah. YouTube? If you like, I can send you the direct uh, link once the class is over. I mean, I mean, what you can do, text me so I can have your uh, your number and then I'm going to send the, the link to you. Oh, okay. To the playlist. Okay. And then you're going to find them in there. Yes. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm also going to share the, you know, the, the uh, link to you too, to everyone in the chat so you can have it. All right. Okay. But yeah, every single class since the first uh, one we had last week on October 12th has been uploaded. Otherwise, I don't get paid, you know, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, really, really, that's how it works, you know. Okay. Okay. Now, let's do something here. I think I have a, a full class already here. Now, let's go to the first conversation, and then let's see if I can find it. Yeah, that's the one. Remember, the first one was divided into, into one, two, three, and four. So get the uh, access information in there and get this, this specific part. As you know, the material that you guys always practice is divided in three parts or three sections. The first one is the script, which is the conversation itself. The next one is the grammar. So you have you know, this specific mm -hmm. part where, where you can actually practice the grammar whenever you have the time. And then you have the quiz. So for the mm -hmm. first one, Go ahead and listen to the conversation, but from this screen, I mean, not mine, uh, but the actual uh, place, you know, you visit in there. And just listen it, I mean, li listen to it one time and send to me a screenshot in the, in the other chat of the score that you got, please. Okay. So I'm gonna give you only two okay. minutes for this, but before I do so, let me just one second, don't start to do anything yet because I want to uh, show you the uh, stopwatch in there. All right, right now just access, you know, to the place in there and then just be ready to, um, to, to take the quiz. So there you go. And let me just one second here. Nice. Uh, let me just move this thing. Because I'm not able to see anything in here. Just one second. This class is almost over, you know. Uh, from yeah, yeah, yeah. right now until nine o'clock or before that, because we need to finish, let's say, uh, one minute before nine. And yeah. one, two, three. Listen to the conversation and take this quiz for us. Okay. Nice. I'm happy that most of you are getting everything correct in here. Nice. Nice. That's pretty nice. All right. Okay. So German already uh, sent his over here. And um, let's see who else in here. Eunice, nice job in there. Great. Yeah. Just in the uh, question number two, where did she use French? I remember that she said that she worked 
for a French company. She didn't say the, she went to France. Yeah. Said, this is in France. I, I don't know. Yeah, I actually don't yeah. remember, to be honest with you, because I yeah. just got this, you know, from her. But okay. let me double, let me double check right now. Yeah, I think, you know, time is up. Now, uh, let's, you know, take the second quiz. I don't think we're going to have time to take, you know, the three of them. But at least go ahead and, and take the next one, which is the simple pass, you know, which I think that was the longest. Where when she went out and, and mowed the lawn and watched, cleaned up the house, that one, okay? Okay. All right, but let, let me go ahead and share the screen with you. I don't think uh, I'm going to have the time, you know, to actually, you know, give you the feedback right away. But at least you, you can send it in this conversation. And yes, Jerma, I'm going to check if your answer was actually correct. You know, regardless, a pesar de, you yes. know, uh, regardless of, of what the website, you know, states, because they might be wrong too, okay? <laughs> yes, yes, no, it's just an uh, observation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so one sec, come in here. The next one was this, the one that starts with, let's see, what did you do yesterday? And then she says, I cleaned up, mowed the lawn, a great housewife, you know? <laughs> okay. Um, so this one, take the quiz, which is this. What did she do in the morning? How did she get to work? How long did she work for? What did she do after work? But, you know, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to give you the feedback because this class is almost over. But take it right now, please. Yeah. So it, it's the second uh, link that uh, material that I sent to you. I can send it to you again, if you like. Correct. Right, so just for the record, I'm sending the, the second uh, quiz in there, okay? Nice, Mr. Franco, you got it first of all. Nice. All right, so my friends, the class is over. I need to let you go because I got to join the next session. But if you like, you can also take the third uh, quiz. Just send it over here just for me to see that you're actually practicing and doing something. All right? Okay, perfect. I finished the okay. three um, quizzes. <clears throat> yeah, okay. yeah, take the three quizzes, you know, uh, I don't know, maybe uh, tonight you take you take the third one or tomorrow, it's up to you. But the I thing is that... Quick conversation. I finished. Okay. <laughs> nice. So, see you next Monday. Okay, so see, you. see you. Thank Good you night. for all. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye.